Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So we are currently digging into the car with me. Babe, say hi. Yo. We are currently on our way to Home Depot because we are getting our garden ready for the season. I am so excited. We're trying this again. Last year was a fail. If you watched any of my vlogs, it did, did not go over very well. So we're gonna try again. We're doing it a lot earlier and I'm really excited. We're gonna get some zucchini. Dagan wants some jalapenos. I'm gonna try bell peppers, tomatoes, obviously, some herbs, and what else? Oh, I wanna try lettuce. So we're gonna look and see what Home Depot has in store, get all of our supplies, and mainly clean up the garden bed today. And then tomorrow we'll probably plant everything, but I am really excited. <music> Alrighty, so we just got home. We got so many vegetables and herbs, which I'm really excited about. Let me show you guys what we got. Okay, so here is all the veggies that we got. We got a tomato plant, some cilantro, a couple peppers that Dagan picked out, basil, rosemary, which I can already tell this thing is going to get big. We got some butterleaf lettuce and then a couple flowers to put in the pot over there and then soil and everything. And then what seeds did we get, babe? Zucchini and sunflowers. Zucchini and sunflowers. So now we just need to get this all back in shape. world's tiniest shovel <laughs> the world's largest tallest man <laughs> okay so while Dagan is tilling up the garden I am going to plant a couple seeds we got some zucchini because I didn't have any in the, like the plant that was already pre-grown so we're gonna put some zucchini seeds in and then Dagan really wanted to do sunflowers so we're gonna put these in some recycled containers that I had in our closet and then we're just going to bring these inside and let them grow and then once they get large enough and sprout then we will put them outside what you doing bubs what you doing come here come here how many sunflower seeds should i put in okay just a zucchini in the pot then yep. so i guess we're putting the sunflower straight in the ground Okay, so now that the garden is all tilled up, we have a bunch of newspaper and I was looking online on YouTube and it's really good to lay down newspaper if your garden bed is prone to like weeds and it'll kind of help like prevent that from like sprouting through. So you put a layer of like newspaper or any type of paper down and then you put your soil on top so that you have like a fresh clean bed. So we have a bunch of leftover newspaper that we're gonna lay down in our bed and then fill it with soil. So I'm thinking, how should we do this? Should we just put rosemary like in the corner so it can like do its own thing? Put herbs in the front so they're easy to grab. Yeah. They can be close together though. So like right there and then the cilantro. Should we put like cilantro right there? Sure. Does that look good? What do you got? Hello. So we have a green bell pepper. I think we're gonna put right here. I'm trying to space out all my plants. And then dig and pick these out. This one is a jalapeno and a, a new Mexico Big Jim. Should we do like kind of like this? 
tomato, which I feel like we'll need a lot of space. So we can kind of like space this bad boy out or maybe put it right here. Oh, this would be a cute thumbnail. <laughs> Should we go like this, this way or this way though? That way. This way? Yeah. This way? That way. And then once the zucchini blossoms, we'll put it at the end here. Pulled out to break the roots up so they can expand out and get some of that good soil. Alrighty guys, so that is the end of this gardening vlog. I will definitely keep you guys posted on how it's growing and how everything is doing. I am very, very excited about this. I am by no means a professional gardener too, by the way. So hopefully we're doing this right. We've never officially like grown vegetables in Texas before. When we were in Hawaii, those things like plants flourished so much. We like hardly had to do anything. So it's a little bit different here. So hopefully we get some crops this year. I'm really, really excited. And yeah, don't forget to like and subscribe and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.